If you've ever fallen into a desert temple and stepped on the pressure plate inside, you would know that exactly 9 pieces of TNT would go off. It's a deadly trap, but still easily survivable. But what if a desert temple had more than 250 times that amount of TNT? You see, today is Monday, and on Thursday, August 26th, the entire server is meeting near the world spawn to establish new server rules. And one person attending that meeting is a PvP expert, the most stacked player on the server, and the only player, as far as I'm aware, that hasn't died on the server. This means that I have exactly 4 days to prepare a bunch of TNT, rig the server with it, and kill the most powerful member alive. <laughs> But getting this amount of TNT is a lot easier said than done. You see, at first, I was planning on blowing up 11,000 total TNT. But if you do the math, that takes 55,000 gunpowder. And if you want to see what that looks like, well, here it is. Around 16 double chests filled to the brim with only gunpowder. Although this was quite a stretch at the time, I was very determined. So I got to work on creating my very first creeper farm. Do you have obsidian? <laughs> Oh, well, can steel. you come and help me? You don't have. Oh. Not the ocean monument. No, I'm creating. You know the. Thing. I thought. I don't have all. Of, I don't have my tools, bro. Minecraft mechanics time. At first, I thought I was going to make this creeper farm super high in the sky. Minecraft basically has a mob cap where, if a certain number of mobs are already spawned in the world, it can really slow down your farm. So my idea was to create a creeper farm really high up so that mobs couldn't spawn anywhere else. But I later learned from a server member named RecRap that if you build your farm really close to bedrock, it can double the spawning rate. So off I went, and let me just tell you, mining out this much space was a pain. Just keep mining up. We need to mine a lot. Good so. night. Sounds good. Okay, now start mining. I'm at this the layer. creeper farm. I'll come. I'll come. I'm like right now. I, I already said I'm at the base. Where? I'm trying to find you. I'm at the mob farm. If you're confused at what's going on at this point, basically two members of our team, Vortex and Spoke, were arguing because Spoke had killed Vortex and stolen his stuff. But you know, I didn't really want to intervene because my only mission was to complete this gunpowder farm. Just saying. Are you close? Yes. I already said I'm at the base, literally. No, you're not. You're not. Wait, Pear, are you getting on the water right here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you, you're, are you at the mob farm, right? No, I'm at the mob. I already told you. I'm, I'm, I'm coming. I found you gotta so much diamonds. You're not coming, bro. You're, bro, I have to go do something. I just want my stuff back. And after Spoke returned Vortex's stuff, and we mined out the space for the farm, built a bunch of platforms, and added some final finishing touches, I headed to a small area to stay AFK a little bit and see how much gunpowder I could gather in one hour. But the results were a bit sad. You see, after an hour of sitting by the creeper farm, I had only gotten one stack of gunpowder. At this rate, I would be nowhere near the thousands of TNT that I would need to get. So I consulted with my friend Vortex and he concluded that since a lot of the caves near the creeper farm didn't have torches in them, mobs could spawn there as well and take up the mob cap. So we set off and this time, our mission was to light up every single cave possible. Where is that zombie? Here. I hear a zombie. I just don't Let's know. Do that wall. There's more gold down here. Okay, hold on. Okay. But there what I think? So I think many zombies. Dude, what the? Is there? Is there a spawner? I think there's a spawner. There's there, gotta this be. Could, like, this could hurt the right There's no. There's no spawner. There's no spawner. Oh, there's just another cave. Like, yeah, I know. Here. We're actually not that far out. Like from the AFK spawn, actually hold on. But one thing we didn't really account for was how truly inefficient this farm was. You see, our design relied on creepers to push other creepers into a bubble elevator. So instead, we made it so that magma blocks would take out the creepers and their gunpowder would shoot up into a hopper system. It's I sat on the side, good. I called get it getting in. good. It's called having good timing. See? Oh my gosh, that was clean! Oh my god! What are you supposed to do? How are they gonna- Oh, you blocked me! Oh my god. I, I can't even do it more than once. Every time I fall on the thing, I take okay, five hearts of damage. No! No, you're gonna kill myself! Stop! Stop! <laughs> oh, oh, no. I'm gonna have a heart. Gonna Come have here. Heart. Come Stop. here. Whoa! Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> No, you got lucky. Okay, okay, stop, 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 st
<laughs> and after messing around for a bit, I decided to AFK the creeper farm overnight. And despite all of our hard work, the results were still not the best. While this was a lot of gunpowder, it was nowhere near close to what I wanted it to be. So, I began stage 2 of the plan. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to present to you Operation Quad Creeper. One creeper farm isn't enough, so I decided to cram four of them in one small space. Every single thing about this creeper farm is going to be optimized in the sense that it's going to be super high in the sky and there will be no place for other mobs to spawn. Let's hope this works. A little thing to add, if you're wondering why we would go through all this trouble to kill one player, well, this SMP is just a little bit different from others. This is the Lifesteal SMP, and basically every single time you kill someone, you steal one of their hearts. And since Cloud Pierce, the most powerful player on the server, hadn't died or been killed once, he had 17 total hearts. If we didn't do something to actually stop him, the server would fall. But first, my teammate Spoke had an important announcement. After this, I had no other choice but to immediately shut off my computer and go to bed. No, I'm just kidding. What I really started doing was gathering a bunch of stone. Me being me, I wanted to build this entire creeper farm out of stone bricks, which takes normal stone to make. So, I stole Rochambeau's Silk Touch pickaxe and began mining. And with all of this newly acquired stone brick, I got to work on wrapping up Operation Quad Creeper. Not only did I have to build the four platforms, but I would also have to build a floor, a roof, and then on top of that, create a storage system and add all the redstone. But I was a bit tired, so for now, I decided to AFK a bit more gunpowder from my old creeper farm. Let's go all the way. I think it's a head hitter. And the next day, after a quick trip to the nether for some magma blocks, I began working on the interior design for the farm. Time was running out. In two days, I would have to have thousands of blocks of TNT rigged under the meeting area. So, a little bit of magma placing, water cleaning, and just eyeballing the entire platform, and I had successfully created the platform. But, while bringing up water to the roof, I made some of the craziest clutches of my life. Oh my gosh, dude. That quick thinking had saved me so much time. And if you're wondering why it's such a big deal that I didn't die, well, not only do you lose hearts when someone kills you, but you also lose one if you die normally. And although you're able to craft them, they require extremely expensive materials. But besides that, we were now in crunch time. We hadn't tested how fast this creeper farm produced gunpowder, and if we had messed up, it could be over. So with Spoke, I began adding the final finishing touches. Wait, if I eat this chorus fruit spawn, the, would, would I spawn this creeper thing? Probably. Get out. Oh. <laughs> 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 okay, we actually so far only have four sticks, so... <laughs> Okay, now you can put it on. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Okay, now it works. It should work, right? Yeah. No, don't. No, stop. <laughs> don't. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Oh, I'm trying to die. And with only 24 hours left, I had no choice but to stay at the creeper farm and let gunpowder accumulate for over 20 hours. My hopes were low, and although I had once wanted 11,000 TNT, it quickly set in how impossible this was. No matter what though, I booted up my AFK laptop and left it alone. By the moment of truth. Oh. I'm sorry. That was the moment just... of truth. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. This amount of gunpowder was not bad at all. In fact, it was just enough to whip up a little under 2,500 pieces of TNT. With all of these explosives, I headed back to spawn in attempts to rig an area. And after searching a little bit through the spawn region, I came across a flat plains biome 
perfect for the task. The location for the server-wide meeting had still not been decided, and if I could convince everybody to go to that location, everything would work out perfectly. So under the cover of the night, I began placing TNT, piece by piece. Alright, are you guys- Klon, are you- er, Spoke, are you ready to take them? I'm rigging up the TNT right now. Yes, sir, bro. Are you sure it's gonna work, though? Yeah, we're gonna convince them to take off their armor. <laughs> okay, <laughs> hold okay, on a minute. Okay, okay, okay. Are you, like, low IQ right now? No, I'm not. <laughs> That's what I was saying, bro. bro. He's gonna we take off his armor. We can just our swords. We can just pull out our swords. But with all of the TNT rigged on the server, we needed some way to convince Clown Pierce's side to come to this location. So, we came up with a genius strategy. Instead of trying to negotiate with them, we would organize a duel. And in this duel, as soon as one person died, the fight would be over. Since Clown Pierce loved to fight, we would give him that experience. And assuming we would lose, it would hopefully make them feel bad and make them more likely to listen to us. So off we went to take Clown Pierce and the MOB in the most strategic fight of the century. Now, I'm not going to go into much detail about the fight, but after Clown Pierce was successful at targeting one player, we had lost. But this had been our motive, and we quickly got the entirety of the opposing nation to follow us to that one location. After hours upon days of hard work, building, and planning, everything would come down to this one very moment. This is... <laughs> Yeah, you're gonna be very interesting. You need to stand behind your like, uh, no, take off your armor. Oh, actually, guys, guys, stop. guys, stop. I thought I was at the sitting tree. Are we taking guys, off wait. our armor? Guys, I don't guys, can see you any killing. All right, take off your guys, armor, guys, please. Take off your armor. Just... Don't kill. Okay, <laughs> Vortex, take off your armor first. My bad, my bad. Take yeah. off your armor have... first. Okay, it's, yeah. it's better. It's Poggies, get be get behind me. Get behind me. All right. All right. Now we can see. Now we can see. Now we can see. <laughs> all right, so first off, first order of business. You can disagree. It's just you talk it up. It's all fine. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 crystals, no so. I, I, I agree. Uh, you know. All right. No um. So yeah, next, first. next. Okay. Uh, next rule. So yeah, griefing and stuff on bases. Um, it's just something that we don't want to happen. Stolen is hearts, basically. That's the whole deal. I think right. the only thing that should be stolen is hearts. And final rule. Final rule. Um, Clown Pierce has to give me one heart. And... Hey, one more thing. Can I say one more thing? Yeah, go for it. Oh my god. I just always want to say, Poggy's on top, baby. Get out! 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 Let's go! Oh I knew you guys were gonna do oh that! Oh my god! Let's go! Oh my god! TNT was at. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god, bro! That's oh huge! My god.